With stress, th that can also make the problem worse. So with time, her vision may come back. Hey, well, th that's some good news, right? It may come back. Yeah. Well, can I donate an eye to her or something? I'd give her one of my eyes. In her situation, the only thing that we can do is wait. I do have some things here. These will help. These are eye patches. She's going to need to wear those all the time. Oh, crap. Okay. The other good news is that we do not need to keep her at the hospital. She'll get to go home today. My name is Dr. Dr. Schleven. Okay. Thank you, Dr. Schleven. Any, any questions? Do not hesitate to give me a call. Okay. 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 Right, thanks. We can you, go home. You ready? Those are not toys. Can I talk to you for a moment? Me? Yes. I'm going to give it to you straight, sir. The vision, it does not look very good. But right now, I would say that might be like a 10% chance of her vision coming back. Are What's you serious? 10% only? What, what could really help those odds yeah, is if, do? if you keep her stress levels low. All but right. right now, it does not getting any worse. Thank you, doctor. Okay, we'll take her home and I'll keep her stress level low. Good luck to you, yes. Thanks, doctor. Love you. We're going to go home now. Hospital gown? What the? Well, there's my camera. Guys, I just woke up. I don't know where I am. The last thing I remember was I was swimming in the pond. I I saw the pond monster and I got sucked underneath the water. Looks like I'm maybe in a hospital. I see there's a, a cable attached to my finger here. And there's uh, some hoses attached to my arm. Oh, there's a screen right here showing my heartbeat. So maybe, did someone pull me out of the pond and rescue me and bring me to the hospital? There's nobody in here. Why is it so dark? Hello? Is any doctors here? Nurses? V? V, are you here? Guys, this is really weird. There's no doctors or no nurses. I don't know where V is. I'm really suspicious because there's nobody here, guys. What do I do? Do I just wait here for a doctor? Is this not even a real hospital, guys? Is this like a, did the hacker bring me here? I'm gonna take off this finger. I think this just tracks my heart rate anyway. If I take this off, no big deal. I'm gonna get up, I'm gonna try to find a light switch, turn the lights on in here. Oh, there's a, there's a cord connected to my, my, my back. What the, why is this in me? Oh, let me pull it out. Ugh. Oh, gross. Why was this stuck into my neck? Oh, here's a light switch, guys. I'm gonna turn on the light switch here. There we go. Yeah, this is definitely a hospital. Check this out, guys. Here's the bed I was sleeping on when I woke up. Here's the heart rate monitor. Here's the weird contraption. Here's the light that was on my face. Oh, man. Oh, huh. My backpack's right here, guys. What, did V bring me here and did V leave me my backpack? When I was swimming, I wasn't wearing my backpack. So maybe, maybe V brought my stuff here. Hmm. I don't know, let me look inside. Oh, it's my clothes, sweet. I'm gonna change out of this hospital gown, guys. I'm gonna put my clothes on, one second. <sighs> All right, there we go, guys. Back into my regular clothes. I put my hospital gown here. I don't know if that's where I should put it, but. So my clothes were in my backpack, but nothing else. My ninja weapons are missing. My phone is missing. Hmm, guys, there's a curtain right here. I'm gonna see what's on the other side of this curtain. Is there somebody over here? somebody in this bed. Who is this? Hello? Hello? Guys, I don't know if this person is sleeping or... Let's see, um, I'm gonna go back over to this area over here. I don't think I explored everything. If looking for more clues, let me know if you see anything of interest that I didn't see before. Lots of, ooh, I'm not gonna touch these. No, thank you. Who knows who's been touching these and where they've been. Wait, wait a second, what is this? Whoa, that looks creepy. Look at this, guys. Huh, what is this? It looks like a person hooked up with their brain hooked up to some tubes. That is really weird. And wait, look at this. Whoa. Wait a second. Is this an x-ray of my brain? Wow, look at this, guys. Because I was laying right here on this bed with a bunch of tubes hooked up to me. Did they take a scan of my brain? And why? It's right underneath it, this image. That, oh, what were they trying to do to me? This is really creeping me out, guys. And why does it show this half of the brain missing? Did they, did they remove half my brain? Wait a second. I remember my parents sometimes saying, what's the matter with you? You only got half a brain? Huh. 
But I think I have a full brain, though. Have, have your parents ever told you that you only have half a brain? Hmm. I don't think that's possible. I think if you only had half a brain, I don't think you'd be walking around. I don't know. What else is over here? There's this weird gadget here. Oh, it's flashing. Zero, zero, three, six, three, six. But it says error, error, help, whoa, help. Internal error. Is someone requesting help? Is this a message? Were they talking about internal error? Were they talking about my brain, inside my brain? Maybe they were trying to do something to me and, they, and then they had an error. Huh. All right, I gotta keep looking around here, guys. There's gotta be a way out of here. There's gotta be something with that drawer and this code right here and these notes. MKU experimentation not effective. Codes. Wait a second. I think where I just was over here, I remember seeing something similar to that right over here. Yes, yes, look at this, guys. There's that exclamation mark right there and that equals some of VT milliliters lock, unlock. And then over here says 600, 600 VT equals tr the triangle exclamation mark. Okay, so wait, if I can get this up to 600, then maybe this will unlock. So wait, how do I, how do I get this up to 600 here? Let's see, can I take this off? No, that doesn't come off. There's like an umbrella. Oh, what? something just fell here. Here's a here's a hose. Where does this hose go to? Oh wait, the hose goes into here and leads into this. Okay, so wait. Hmm. Let me let me try something. I got an idea, guys. So I think if I blow into this, this will go up. I think it's a breathing contraption. Whoa! It works! Yes! Okay, so if I can blow hard enough and I can get it all the way up to 600, then I don't know, maybe I'll unlock something. Something will happen, I can get out of here. We'll find out. <gasps> I need to take a really deep breath. All right guys, wish me luck. <sighs> oh, okay, let me try again. I gotta blow harder. I didn't get high enough. I heard something, I heard something over here. Guys, I think I just heard something over here. Oh my gosh, I'm so dizzy, I, I blew so hard. Okay, was it this? Oh geez, what is gonna be in here? I hope that worked. Let's see. Whoa, it opens. That's what got unlocked. Whoa, look at this. It's a key. Is this gonna get me out of here? Oh gosh, let's see. Wait, wait a second. There's no keyhole. How do I get through this door? There's no key. Wait, let's try. Yes, yes, okay, okay. Let's see, let's see if this works. Let's see if this works. Go in there. Whoa! It worked, guys. Okay, guys, I'm gonna go through this doorway. Huge shout out to all of you notification ninjas who get here during the first 60 minutes of every video. I'm showing your comments down here. Thanks for having that bell symbol ringing so you can get here and hang out with me on every video. You guys, you gotta go over to V's video right here. Let her know that I'm trapped inside of a hospital. Let her know I don't have my phone and I can't communicate with her. So I need you guys to communicate with her, okay? So check out her video right here. Let her know where I am. Guys, make sure you are subscribed to me by clicking right here. Make sure that bell symbol's ringing because I'm gonna go through this door right here. I want you guys to be here with me when I go through there, okay? I'll see you guys real soon. Kick bump! <laughs> Doors over here. Yeah, guys, let me know if you see any clues. I'm gonna scan this room right now, and you guys can help me. Let me know if you see any clues on how I might be able to get out of here. Okay, those look kind of interesting, those bottles there. Hmm, okay, I'm just gonna go look around and see what we can find. Huh, what's this? Hmm, monkey paw hybrid, eight grams. Whoa, that's really weird. Remember we thought that the hacker might be growing pond monsters? Well, monkey paw hybrid. Hybrid's like when you combine two things into one. Is he combining pond monsters with monkeys? I don't know, this is really strange. Just a bunch of bottles. Let me see. It's locked. These are all locked, so it's nothing in there. There's my gown that I took off. This air, oxygen. Wow, a bunch of strange devices here. Huh. What is this thing? VT, Ooh, wait, alarm, alarm sets. Interesting, low VE, low O2, high O2. Alarm sets, okay, so maybe this is how we disable the alarm in this room in case I need to break that window. It might be this device, I'm not sure. What's this thing? 
This looks interesting. Bunch of numbers on it. Huh. Exclamation VT milliliters. I don't exactly know what that means. Oh look, lock, unlock. Huh. Maybe this has something to do with unlocking something? Since there's a lock here? Interesting. Okay, I'm gonna remember this. Let's go explore the other side of this where this creepy bed was. Okay, there's a, there's a chart here. A clock that doesn't seem to be moving. So I don't even know what time it is right now because this clock is out of batteries or something. Wait, wait, wait a second, what's this? Date, July 20th, I think that's today's date. Patient number 17, Chad Wild Clay. Height, six foot four, weight 176. Notes, MKU experimentation, not effective. What does that mean? What does MKU mean? Guys, if you know what MKU means, leave a comment below or keep your eyes peeled. Maybe there's a clue that will tell us what MKU means. I don't know. And what is this? This says code, like a password or a passcode? 600 VTML equals exclamation mark. Weird, okay. I don't know. I don't know what to think about that. What else is in here? Uh, oh, there's a drawer. Wait a second. Do you guys see this? Oh, it's a triangle with an exclamation mark on it. Does that mean there's something important in here? Wait, let me try this one. Okay, those won't open. There must be something important in these drawers if this triangle was on it. Wait, wait a second. This triangle, look at that. This triangle matches up with this one where it says code. Okay, wait, so code, if this was on the drawer, Maybe this is the code to get into the drawer? How do I put this code into the drawer? There's no digits or numbers. Okay, we'll have to, hmm, okay. We'll keep looking around. I think this is something to do with getting into that drawer. There must be something important in there. I think that is the drawer we need to get into. Maybe there's something in there that we need to know. I'm gonna keep looking for clues over here to see if I can figure out how to get in to that drawer. All right, let's see. V? V is this, are you in this bed, V? Why would, you, why would she be in the bed? She, unless she, did she jump in the water to get me? Guys, give me a thumbs up if you want me to see who's sleeping in this bed right now. A little bit freaked out. I mean, it looks like they're taller than V. I don't think it's V. It looks like someone pretty tall. Gosh, this is creepy. Hello? What? There's, there's no one here? Whoa. Guys, I, I swear, I swear I saw someone sleeping underneath this blanket, but there's no one here. Was, was the blanket just like bunched up? Do you guys think there was a person under here too? Leave a comment down below if you thought you saw a person or let me know if it was just my imagination. Oh my gosh, I am really freaked out guys. I, I think I'm gonna get out of here. So there's a couple doors over this way. I'm gonna get out of here. This is really weird. Shoot, it's locked. I wish V was here with her spy gadgets because I know she'd be able to just get right into this no problem. It looks like a pretty easy one that she could do. And I don't have my phone, so I can't call her and I can't text message her to let her know where I am. So let me try this door over here. Wait a second. What's this say? To open this door, purge the words. Do not disturb. Huh, what does that mean? Okay, yeah, that's locked. I can't get out there. This has gotta be a clue on how to open this door. So remember this sign, guys, I'm gonna come back to this. Only two doors in here are that one and that one. I'm gonna need your help, so please keep your eyes open. Let me know if you see anything strange going on. Okay, wait, I thought I just heard something by this window. Guys, did you hear something in this window here? Let's take a look. What is out here? Hard for me to see, guys. Let me know if you can see anything. I, I see like a whiteboard, but I can't really tell what it says. Another last resort, I can maybe crawl through that window into that other room. Oh, maybe I can climb out this window right here. Yeah. Sweet, I can probably climb out this window. Oh, there's cars driving around, great. So I'm, I'm somewhere where this populated. Wait a second. Do you guys see this? Is this? That's, our, that's V's Tesla. Wait a second. Our Tesla got stolen a couple of videos ago 
And here it is, sitting right outside this window of this hospital. That looks just like it. It's a silver Tesla Model X. Oh, wow. Guys, whoever stole our Tesla, maybe that's the person that brought me to this hospital. Now, now I really need to get out of here because if it's the person who stole the Tesla, I think that was the hacker. Wow, I really need to get out of here. I'm gonna try to open this window right now. Okay, how do I? Oh wait, I can lift up this blind right here, but there's no handle. It's not a window that can open even. Just a solid window. I'm gonna have to break the glass to open up this window and there might be an alarm on it and who knows who's gonna come running through those doors over here. So I'm not gonna do that yet. That's gonna be my last resort to get out of here. I think I might be able to unlock one of these